After the monumental success of the original Space Gar, there were serious concerns about the future of the series. Space Gar became very popular, in fact it was a household name. But what sequel could possibly live up to the original brilliance of Space Gar? To complicate matters, the development team had it in their contract that they would spend the entirety of the profits on drugs and alcohol, which they did, resulting in the first Space Gar to be pulled from the market for a name change. Physically unable to comprehend any sort of rational thought or even program, the designers actually misspelled the title of the game, releasing it to the public as Space Guard 2, The Wreath of Space Guard. Gameplay changed little, in fact it was pretty much the exact same game because the programmers couldn't program. We're watching footage of Space Guard 2, but as you can see on screen, initially it looks identical to Space Guard 1. The music is different, but that's not programmed into the game. The game was shipped with a different Edison cylinder to play on the Atari X5201. The only real difference between Space Guard 1 and Space Guard 2 is the level 3 weapon upgrade, which was accidentally programmed into the game when the development team tried to order a pizza using their computer by mistake, giving the game its most notable feature and making Space Guard 2 even more popular and successful than the original Space Gar. The level 3 weapon upgrade gave it a marketable title, launching it into international success, doubling its audience, and launching a series of poorly produced popular cartoons. When you reach level 3, you equip Space Gar with its new weapon, the bow. The bow was not just decorative, it launched invisible space arrows at the invisible aliens causing twice the damage. How they improved upon the already perfect space guard is just, it's beyond me, I mean it's amazing. You've got to play it to see for yourself. Even though the Atari X5201 only has one button, depending on what you say to it, it will either fire the standard weapon or fire the space guard bow, which of course takes longer to reload. Space Guard 2 The Wreath of Space Gar was quickly pulled from the shelves, retitled Ms. Space Gar, and launched again with a huge international media campaign, making it one of the most successful video games in history. So if you, if you can find one of the original ones entitled The Wreath of Space Gar, I hear that it's worth at least 5 yen. Anyway, as you guys know, the rest is history. Space Gar is one of the most popular game series ever created. Sadly, the original development team did not live to see the commercial success of Ms. Space Gar. Tragically, as they were waiting for their pizza to arrive, they died of starvation. It's common practice among fans of the games to think of Space Gar each time you eat a slice of pizza. Drop a pepperoni on the floor for your dead homies who created Space Gar and Ms. Space Gar. In an epic tale of woe, the design team would be replaced, resulting in one of the biggest disappointments in video game history, Space Gar 3. But there's no time to worry about that when you're busy playing the masterpiece of gameplay known as Ms. Space Gar. Love this game. Highly recommended.